welcome back. Don't sound so again. depressed. Well, I'm not really happy to be back, but um. Yeah, it's a bit of a pain to sit next to you all day. Yeah. Anyway, um. Anyway, we're back with day four. Game two, Scarlet versus Fog, ZVZ. Round of eight. Okay. Okay. Uh, Scarlet up one game after a Temple Bane defense off of the hatch first. Pretty impressive. But, um, yeah, I mean, Fog's control kind of... Slipped a little bit. Yeah. Wasn't wasn't quite where it should have been. And the second map is going to be King Sejong Station. Yeah. Are you a fan? Um, not for CVZ. No? Not you don't really. like playing two hour long games? Well, no, I don't like maps that force you to open gas. That's Why not? the main thing. Because gas I like is to great. choose whether I want to go gas or gasless. Gas is great. <coughs> Yeah, maybe for, like, a gimmicky player like you. <laughs> but, yeah, I don't know. The The ramp is so wide that you pretty much have to open yeah. gas and then, like... Like, it takes four evos to wall off. That's ridiculous. Um, so mid is a super common, I guess, on this map. Um, I don't know. It's Other than that, it's a pretty standard map. Obviously, this is where I had my stupid swarm host game against Afana, so it brings back bad memories. Not that anybody cares about that. Wow. Man wow. place. <laughs> um, yeah, what fourth base do you take? In what matchup? I don't play this map, so... You don't, you veto this yeah, map. I don't like it the first turn. Alright, yeah. Yeah, it's pretty hard this turn. <coughs> anyway... In the top left-hand corner of King Sejong Station, we have the Red Zerg, Acer's Scarlet. Uh, she came up with a pretty, pretty good win. Um, pretty solid. Yeah. And in the bottom right-hand position, we have from Team IVD, Fog, currently down one game. Rob. Who's, who's um, wait, you go. I was going to ask Rob if he could confirm that IVD is actually Ivy Drip. Okay. Seems a bit odd. Did you know that? No, I didn't. Hmm. Interesting. Hmm. Looks like two hatch first. Whose decal do you prefer, David? I like the IVD one better than the Acer. No, I mean the, um... Yeah, these ones. Like the monster logo. That's basically oh, what okay, this okay, is. Okay. Or Scarlet's. I think it's like a brood something. It looks like the oh, Phoenix. Char. I think it's called, like... Some, Don't even try. Or char. Uh, I think I like I used to have the that. one Fog's using That's better. the one you get with the Ultralist portrait, I'm pretty sure. Rob, <coughs> can you confirm? Rob from production Rob cannot, cannot confirm. confirm. Okay. Um, anyway, I think gas. I like I like Fog's one better. Yeah. So it was a hatch gas pool for Fog, right? <coughs> yeah. Yeah. And Scarlet got the pool before the gas. Um, she got the gas at 2 minutes 57, which is like the latest you can get it Which is if you like want to survive against hatch gas pull. The Ehan Petraeus gas yeah. timing. Well, that's my 15 pull timing. I don't usually do it with hatch gas, uh, with hatch fast. But, yeah. So, Fog is like a... It's gonna have a faster speed. It doesn't necessarily equate to a lead. In fact, it doesn't, unless he like, wants to do something aggressive. But even then, like, it's not necessarily gonna work. It's just going to mean he has speed faster, so he can move out a bit faster. It's, what, um, it's not going to be like 10, 15 seconds, so yeah, not the biggest of deals. Yeah, it's not going to like mean he... How I wins the game. No, it's, not, it's like not going to mean he has speed faster in an engagement, just that yeah, he can cause move out faster. If Scarlet stays passive, yeah. Cause generally, she might have speed... Yeah. When he gets there. Generally, you don't want to move out with links out of your base. Unless, unless you have speed. Or unless you're Destiny. He, like, rocks out <laughs> with fucking 20 links. Like, slow links. Off of gas. Yeah. No, no, off gas. But it's like, when a, he does it's like a 2 minutes 57 gas. And he sends 20 links, slow links. And <laughs> they only get speed that? once they arrive to your base. It's like the Destiny build, I don't know. What about people who go, like, hedge gas pool? Well, it... Wrecks it, obviously. Why anyway, do we that? have Fog An Evo for plus one carapace for Bane Nest. 
So yeah. this is interesting. Um, he did this first me, I think. We he put the evo at the natural, so I scouted and did the mini special and it reacted. But, you hit um, before. This is a bit more hidden. Uh, so... And Scarlet's been super safe. Yeah, even then he has spine. Jeez. Yeah, spine. What do you think about morphing bane lanes? Without seeing anything? Without no. seeing it. No. Yeah, I don't, I don't know like why, it. like, so many top players do it. There's always enough time to morph it yeah, if you definitely. watch it, right? Yeah. I guess it's kind of a safety look at her, net. Look at her overload path. Like, she would see yeah. lanes, like, almost the whole way across I mean, the map. Sometimes you're not looking at your mini map. Like, you should be, but... Like, I've lost a couple games to that. Where... I mean, it could just be like, okay, I'm going to do it anyway. And then I won't have to be so attentive to the minimap, maybe. Yeah. yeah, it could be. But as a general rule, I don't like it. Anyway, she's going for uh, the range book. attack yeah. before lair. Yeah. Which is something that's really, really good in this situation. Yeah, Fog's just pumping out the Fog's lanes. Because doing a plus one carapace all-in. That's When you get the carapace before the bane nest, it's generally because you want to do an all-in. Um, that was like a, a good detonation for yeah. a fog. Um, he is getting a lair. Wait, yeah. he's getting a lair by an end of fast turn. He just produced, and he's still producing a lot of. Lanes. Wait, is there no bane nest? No, he did grab bane nest. Okay. After the like, this is pretty weird. Three guesses. But Scarlet's build is insanely good. Like, if fog went straight up meters, going like an upgrade before lair is. Pretty risky because your road speed's gonna be so delayed. Um, I mean, I don't like it. He's gonna cancel the third 100%. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But in this case, she's gonna be able to do a solid road timing without any threat of meters. Yeah, she's got a <coughs> big window of yeah. opportunity. And she's gonna have a solid um, upgrade lead. Oh, there is. There are gonna be no meters for Falk. He's grabbing the road yeah, and yeah. the plus one range. I mean, you so, have plus one carapace, it's pretty weird to go meters Yeah, so there. Scarlet has a huge upgrade advantage if she wants to hit a timing yep. attack. Yeah, and she also... Has a like, speed advantage. All these links are not that great against roaches as soon as the upgrade's done. Like, upgraded yeah. links are only ever good against unupgraded roaches, pretty much. Um, especially with this Bane Lane support that Scarlet's gonna have. So I feel like she's gonna wait for roach speed. And she's still gonna take her third, but I think we could be seeing like a sizable roach timing. Yeah, definitely. The banelings will deal with the lings and the roaches. She's making our lings. number and our upgrade. She's making lings just probably. Yeah. That's what you will kind of make when your roaches are like halfway across the map, so that they get to I the mean, fight. It's probably the gas to mineral ratio is causing the making. Good fight, um, bro. She didn't detonate banes unnecessarily. No. And she starts her plus two right away, so she's gonna keep the upgrade lead going. Um, if we look at the income box up ten workers, so if he can hold this, yeah, which he feels, should be able to with defender's advantage, then he'll be in a good spot. Yeah, I feel like these links would be better across the map, thrown into counter. Um, yeah, just split I them off with, from your yeah. roaches. With bane lanes and upgraded roaches in the composition, I don't see them doing a whole lot. I don't know, Scarlet did make a lot of links, so I guess having a few bane lanes like this does help. Um, yeah, as you can see, positioning Bob becomes is like a upgrade. I mean, uh, upgrade deficit, but a supply lead. There's a lot of bane links coming for Scarlet. Yep, that was Ooh, good. That was a, yeah. Fog. yeah, really good. I think Fog's gonna push his bag really yeah. easily. He can even counter push I now think, with how many roaches yeah, that she just lost. I think he could lost. win the game, maybe. Like, generally in ZVZ, He's you up never 40 want to attack unless, you've, unless your opponent has just attacked into you and traded badly because defendant's advantage is ridiculously strong in this matchup. But... But yeah, yeah, Scarlet's down 40 He's supply. He's gonna hit for 4 plus 2, so even upgrades. The spine is gonna help out, but... He's <laughs> such it's an not enough. There's no way. Well, maybe actually. Oh, no. Defendant's advantage is so good, baby. He's rallying, though. He rallied the links so they would get there faster. I'd like to see him maybe drone at this point. Because it kind of looks like he might Morning. not be able to Yeah, he might be. Oh, right. He's dead, yeah, he's dead. Yeah. There's the G. The G, the G, which people like Petraeus are anal about. Yeah, well, if you G, it's not as good as a G. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be real. Generally, a G is not a mistake. 
this Which means exceptions, what? What does it mean if well, I, means if you purposefully type out one G? It, I mean, it's the same thing as like Stefano typing out congrats or well done. You want like you know you have to say something because it's a tournament game, but you don't want to commit to that full GG, <laughs> all right? Because then you're acknowledging like your opponent's win. So you think that Stefano cops out of it like every game? Yeah, yeah, he does. Okay. And, like, people who type G, sometimes it's a mistake because, you know, you're quickly typing GG and then F10 and N. But I feel like most of the time, it's a cop you're just like, you know, this is a 1G game, not a 2G <laughs> game. <laughs> well, <coughs> the scores are tied up 1 to 1. Yeah. And we're going to take a short commercial break. <laughs> 